What is up guys, this is Moritz here from Section Store once again and today we will be having a look at this image cards section right here where you do have the possibility to add three different pictures, also add a little bit of a degree to them and in the next step you can also add a text if you hover over them and it creates a little overlay on all the other ones and I think it's a really nice complementary section if you want to add some new product shots of actual products you just add it to your store and I used it for this little test store I did for section store and I just used a bunch of random example pictures right here but I do think it goes really well with the branding of the store and I'm going to show you how you can install that for yourself. The first thing you have to do is actually heading on over to the Shopify app store where you gotta get the section store app and in the next step you can easily open up the section store app in your Shopify admin area. The app itself is completely free and it does come with 150 full customizable components which you can easily install right here if you click on explore sections they do either come completely free or with a little charge of nine dollars like this one it's one of our premium sections because the setup is quite complex and yeah like i said already one time charge of nine dollars that means you don't have to pay like any subscription fees and you're not going to need a developer to build this for you because i'm pretty sure it's going to cost more than nine dollars to build complex sections like this one in the next step you hopefully downloaded the section for yourself before you can actually use it you have to add it to your theme in my case it's the dawn live theme and then you can easily open up the theme editor right here which i've already done here to save some time for you guys that's by the way also one of our banner sections i just brought out a video to that one you can find that one in our store as well but let's continue with the one we were just speaking about it's the one you saw in the beginning of the video and if you haven't edit the section yet just have to type in this image section store image cards that is the one I was referring to and it's going to give you this little default version right here let's always save it up if you added a new section like that you can avoid any crashes of the section itself and if that has loaded up we can immediately start editing it perfect that is looking good the first thing I want to do actually Let's show you how to add a picture. So the section consists out of this main block where you can do customization things to the whole thing itself. And here in those little blocks, you can add the actual images. I'm just gonna do a random one, just as an example to show you how it's done. And it should update in the live version immediately. That is looking good to me. And here you can see the text also, which you're gonna get if you hover over it. So here we have story, destination everywhere, Singapore inbound, and you can add this little button as well. If you hover over it, that is looking nice already. And another thing I wanna show you is that you can also add this little link right here. So you can connect the product to it. I'm just gonna do a really random one. I just wanna show you that it's possible. So if you have a product shot or like a mood shot, of a product of your own store, you can easily link that to that. And yeah, let's say we just give this a little save and up right here. So yeah, as you can see here, we could easily add this image right here. And if we scroll all the way to the top again, we can see the one I used in the beginning of the video. So I'm just gonna get rid of that and show you all the customization things you can do to the whole block itself. So if you click on it, you can see here already the first thing we can change is this headline right here the heading size also the font is fully changeable the pagination right here is something we can change as well same as line height and the mobile size as well then the slider margin so how much space there is actually then the next thing we can do is changing the sub headlines so those are things right here and a bunch of other things regarding the fonts and everything and here we have the button underline too. And that's the last thing we can do to the whole thing. is changing all the colors from this block right there. And the last thing I want to do is actually having a look at it. So as you could see right here, it's all the colors we can change and customize. So pretty much everything in this whole block is changeable. So as well as the background too. So yeah, that's our store. Perfect. And yeah, that's the one you saw in the beginning of the video. And I hope you guys found it useful. If there are any questions, always feel free to reach out to us in the comment section. And if you have any suggestions yourself of sections we can build and that would interest you, 
leave them in the comments as well. And with that being said, have a good one, guys, and peace out.